What's going on everybody, it's Lang Dutchman here and today I have all the space. Today is the day that I have all my space to myself here available. No boats, no nothing. Uh, I took the wall out already, the footage of there is now. And um, today, everything else is out. So what did I do? Just put two flags up because they were tucked there in the corner and one was already sagging. So I need to fix that one. Um, I'm just gonna take everything out. This fish eye is not doing it justice though. Because this feels way, way smaller on the camera. If I look through the camera then, look, th this distance to that wall looks further away then now from left to right, right? Anyway, need to get these out of here. Maybe you make some uh, shelving out of them because I have more of them because we're gonna take that wall out as well. And then put two tables here. So sort of the same as the workbenches, but just, you know, drag it along. Uh, then we can put the Celica back in here. And then the Civic as well is gonna be standing here because there is somewhat, I think I wanna create somewhat of a sitting corner or just chill so if you're with your mates uh, you know you have some comfort as well as you can see the ground is filthy there's all nasty stuff here so I'm gonna you know sweep it down uh, simply just get most of it out and then I'm gonna pour some water on the ground and get all the dust and everything out so we begin as clean as possible I mean there's always dust gonna settle from this place but you know if we take most of it out because there's so much on the ground still. Uh, this has become a lot better over the time because you know we're working here and you're keeping it clean but to begin every time you you know you stamp down you just saw dust going everywhere so uh, and I was never able to you know clean this and maybe it doesn't look this bad or as bad but then you do this And then you can see the difference, how much dust there is. So, let me just uh, sweep it all down. So after three flushes, you can see how nasty and brown the water is. And the water that was scraping off now on this side is somewhat clean. Buddy Elmer here is helping me. Kind of a blessing, because on my own it would be a lot more work, but uh, I'm making it clean. I put the tables to the back side, put the cars, that needs to be there. And then uh, we can sort of clean this side a little bit. We have it all somewhat done for now. Oh, and of course, take that last bit of wall out and everything. So we pick it up when the floor is all nice and clean and as good as dry. Also, I was planning to do a little bit of shelving with the beams that I have. So we're gonna make a little frame, put it up against the wall and uh, see what we can make out of it. So everything is out. So we can now start cleaning this pile of mess up, but we get distracted with a little side project because I wanted to make some shelves and I'm thinking I can just make like two frames like this and just put it up against the wall there in the corner. And then we have plenty of shelving spacing to, to put stuff on. So uh, we're just figuring out which of the beams are the best for using, because you know some are longer, some are shorter, and it's a pain in the ass. But uh, we just need two more, and we can put it up the wall, and then just probably just screw it into the wall that it's secured. And uh, well, two more. So, buddy has left. Uh, push the car in because it had a little bit of a flat tire on that side so it's easier to push in over the hump so car is in I can now push it into the corner uh, we did the both frames I uh, already put some junk in there it's like frame one and frame two little cross beams in between and then we have the other planks that we had There's still a few there uh, they were shorter 
uh, as you can see. But we just placed the, the little beam here and now it's uh, three wide. And uh, I think this is more than enough for what we need. Uh, if I had another one that had the right size, I would have placed it on top, made another shelf there, but we'll see how we're gonna fix that. At least for now, I have three big shelves that I could put a lot of stuff in. And then we're gonna put the silica in here, like very tight up against this, that I can basically just walk in between here, because this is just stuff that I don't really need as much. So there's as much space to this side so I can really work on the Civic. So now that pile and everything is gonna be, um, give that a different place. Then we can start working on uh, getting the cars properly in their place. So that one back, that one here in the corner. Then we can work on this corner, clean it up a little bit. So this is where I'm gonna leave it for now because dinner time uh, and the dinner is ready. The miss is called. Um, Silica back in the corner. Got two tables now for basically all of this shit can go straight to there so this is like all nice and clean and after I because of course now I did a lot of cleaning and everything to get this part free so there's a lot of stuff here but hopefully I can get all of this off so it's a nice empty workbench to work on because uh, you can hit this with a hammer and be safe those tables a little bit less so the tables are gonna be more for storage and this more for working um, yep I'm gonna leave it at that uh, so, um, we did a thing. We had so much more shelving there in the back now that we decided that we have a lot of stuff there in the corner and we're gonna place all that shit in here. Or at least most of it. So that's out of the way. Uh, so the, the the shelving that we had that is gonna be on that wall now. We're just gonna extend it. Got one here. And we're gonna take all that shit out, move it into that one, and also combine it with the other one because I got a little table, and behind there you can't really see it, but there's a sofa. Um, so we're gonna make a little sitting corner and also if I can get all this shit out of this corner and give that a different spot because I have the wheels already here. Um, there was the wood before, the planks and everything. But probably gonna make a little kitchen-ish area here, like a, a counter and the sink. So I'm gonna place the sink from there and then switch it up over to there in the corner. Also, first time using a gimbal. Let me know how you like it because uh, it's a little bit, it's something to get used to, but at least the image now is, is smooth. So after a lot of work, the couch and the table are somewhat in position. Now there's a lot more stuff like, we got the seats and everything up. I don't know where I left off with the previous. Uh, don't know where I left off with the previous bit, but most of the stuff is off. And we just oh man, I have to point with this thing, especially if you walk around, which is kind of annoying. But uh, we made some shelves. Uh, like last part, we already did that part, and now we did another one here. I put the bumpers in there because. You know, they're pretty big and inconvenient to place them anywhere else. But uh, as you can see, it's very narrow. So it's not that, that far off the wall. So it's safe space. You can go up and this is just, it's perfect. Push the Celica back. Now we can push the Civic back, which in case you're wondering, I'm doing some work on it. Uh, that will be in another video soon, hopefully. Uh, engine on the stand let's give that a nice spot again and then uh, it starts to look like the empty nice workspace that it was 
So just uh, little bits. I don't know where to go from this point because I have so many stuff and this can go there and that can go there and you know I have to just figure out what goes where and it's a little bit annoying but at the end of the day we're we're gonna make it so stay tuned for the next bit. So I think we kind of had a productive day this needs to be sorted out just a little bit because uh, like this glass is way too vulnerable standing right here and also, yeah, it's not coming too far off the wall, everything, but still, I want to see if I can, you know, fix this up a little bit. But I think now I officially cleaned everything up, sort of. Uh, we got the tire corner, everything here. Uh, the sink I removed because we decided to keep this sort of a more of a tire corner and then use this corner that we were able to empty out. This is somewhat gonna be the, the kitchen. So I'm gonna have like a, a countertop, then the sink. So this corner nice stuck to a sort of the clean corner. So let me work with that a little bit. I have a countertop that I can use. I also have a another countertop that I can use if I want a different gap, but there's a few holes in them only. Uh, and behind that, there's like a plate that has like the look of tiles. So it's a little bit water resistant. And, and I think that is a lot better to put it here. So, um, I think I'm gonna leave it for now because, you know, I have done a lot today. Like everything is somewhat back in its place, in a place, new place, um, and just, you know, uh, I have to clean up the workbench. So this is all nice and clean. The vise, I think, from that corner, I'm gonna place it here, so it's nice in the middle, and you have the space to work with stuff. And the chill area, where there's gonna be, I think, another couch. We'll see. Just a sort of a nice spot to hang out with your mates. I think I've said everything I wanted to in this video. Um, so I want to thank each and everyone for watching uh, a little shop update which especially if we're gonna stand here you can see the whole thing and it's amazing I'm happy with it so like subscribe see you guys in the next video thanks for watching peace